Welcome to What Would My Kid Do? The game show where parents compete against each other to see if they can guess what their kid buys when we give them 100 bucks to buy whatever they want at different stores. It's time to see who can prove that they know their kid the most. Do you know what you're doing here today? No, no, not really. We are going to give you this hundred dollars and you can buy whatever you want in this store. And you're gonna buy whatever you want. Dun, 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 and my name is Nicole. I'm Sydney's mom. I believe Sydney on her trip to the toy store will be overwhelmed and extremely excited. I'm Shannon, I'm Max's mom, and I think that on his trip to the toy store, he was probably really excited and then probably tried to keep the money for himself. <laughs> I think she's gonna win because Max's interests are super limited, and so if he goes beyond that, I have no idea what he's gonna pick. How did Sydney react when she discovered she got $100 to spend at the toy store? Was she happy and thankful for the $100? Was she surprised in disbelief and questioned the producer? Did she doubt the $100 was real and checked to make sure? <laughs> or was she frozen and didn't know what to do or say? I would say B. Okay, let's uh, go ahead and throw the headphones on and see if you're correct. <laughs> really? Anything? Why? <laughs> How irresponsible can you be to give a 10 year old $100 in a toy store? What? You're wasting your money. <laughs> so cute. Oh, she's so funny. So the next question is gonna be for Max. Okay. Max mentions he normally doesn't play with toys. How does he usually spend his free time? Drawing, playing video games, playing on the iPad, or playing outside? I think he said an iPad. I don't normally buy toys a lot. I normally play on my iPad. <laughs> <laughs> you do yeah. know him. What stuffed animal does Sydney decide to buy? Is it a dog, a koala, a bear, or a bunny? I would definitely say A. Sydney would want the dog. She wants a real dog. We already have two, but she wants a third dog so bad. I don't want any dolls. I don't need any of these horses. I spend my money wisely. Oh my gosh, I love dogs. Oh my gosh, stuffed animals are the best. Aww. I need more. Oh, look at the koala. <laughs> it's so cute. Okay, I'm getting you. Okay, let's keep going. I thought for sure she'd pick the dogs. What did Max do when he got to the Nerf gun aisle? Did he decide to buy it? Did he decide to buy it, then put it back? Did he take it out of the package to try it? Or he didn't even notice it, and he just walked by? I think he might have bought one and then put it back because he would like it, but then he would be afraid that he would miss something else if he didn't check out the entire store and then make a purchase. Cool. Oh. Um, that's a big one. <laughs> I'm not sure I'm gonna buy that, because that's a lot. <laughs> right on. Which one of the following does Sydney not get? in the toy store. Does she not get a stuffed koala, a hacky stack, a pony stick, or a twister? Um, oh goodness. I'm say D. I've never tried hacky stack. Oh. I'll try there it. There you go. Sure, new hobbies. I'll get twister. Oh. There oh, you gosh. go. I don't get even know my child. Basket. Ooh, I used to love these as a kid, but I already have one at home, so. <laughs> I'm sorry. So, now we're on to Max. What type of toy car did Max decide to buy? Is it a remote control oh. car, a Transformers car, oh. a bulldozer, or a Power Wheels car? Definitely not a bulldozer. That would just floor me if he decided to go, like, construction. <laughs> I'm thinking a remote control car, and it's gonna be a fancy one. I think a remote control cars are... They're cool, that's 79, so that's the money dollars. <laughs> Let me grab it for you. Cool. So, you want me to toss it in your basket? There we go, we still got 20 bucks. You're three for three right now. Why yes. do you think uh, you're doing so well? Because his interests are very specific right now. So it's kind of easy for me because 
He doesn't play with a lot of toys, he never has, and so when he's into something, it's very, like, saturated into that one thing. What does Sydney say when we tell her to spend her money wisely? Oh, God. So, here are the options. All right. She appreciated it. She talked down to us. Oh! She asked for us to help her keep track. Oh. Or she ignored us completely and moved on. Oh, my goodness. It could be any of those. <laughs> <laughs> D. I'm going to say D. Just throw it out there. She probably ignored you and just moved on. You know, I mean, you've got... You can probably splurge a little. <laughs> No, no, just, just, just no. <laughs> You're not the one to talk about spending your money wisely. You just gave me a hundred dollars. <laughs> oh. Think about what you're saying. Wow, <laughs> schooled you, didn't she? Oh, look at that. Man, I feel schooled all the time by her. It's, it's brutal. Awesome. It's brutal. Which Star Wars Aww. figurine did he get for his father? So cute. Oh, he actually thought of his dad. Was it Darth Vader? Oh my God, Jar Jar. Luke <laughs> Skywalker. Obi-Wan Kenobi or Jar Jar Binks? It's Jar Jar. His father will never speak to him again. <laughs> it has to be Darth Vader. It has to be. My husband dresses as Darth Vader as a cosplayer. My dad loves Star Wars things, which is kind of <laughs> weird. And I don't. You know, there's a bunch of Star Wars things right behind us back here. It has to be. Okay. I think I'm gonna get the Jar Jar from my dad, and that's only $15, no. so I still have five. I have no words. <laughs> that is awesome. None. Oh, I love it. I don't even know what his dad's gonna do. What story did Sydney tell about the boomerang she got from her aunt? Did she break it? <laughs> did she lose it? Did she break a window with it? Or did she hit her brother with it? She probably hit her brother with it. I'm almost positive. Aunt got me a boomerang because she went to Australia. And what happened was I tried to throw it, and I think I accidentally hit my brother in the face. I'm not sure, though. I forget. Don't blame me, though. Blame my aunt because she got it. <laughs> <laughs> See? I figure her brother's a glutton for punishment with her. Got another point on the board. Woo! Woo! All right. No, shut no, out. I don't even know what's going to happen after the last one. Right. Whew. Has your confidence been shaken? Yes, my whole world has been shaken. I can't go Jar Jar Binks, you'd be dreaming I, of Jar I can't Binks. even. So. <laughs> Shocker. <laughs> Max spent too much. Really? What was an item that he put back? Please, sweet lord, let it be Jar Jar. <laughs> was it the remote RC oh. car? Was it a no. small cop car? Was it his dad's oh. Jar Jar Binks? <laughs> <laughs> or was it a stuffed can't toy? Go on. Well, I want it to be C, but I can't imagine him buying a small cop car in the first place. But now I don't. I question everything that I know about my <laughs> own child. Um, I think he put back a stuffed toy because he has one thousand of them. Here comes the one twelve seventy five. Oh, I need. Oh man. You have to put something back. Um, I'll put the Jar Jar back. Yes. <laughs> Phew. I mean, I, I lost a point or whatever, but it's worth it. Congratulations, Shannon. You won with three points. Chopper. Yeah, right. Congratulations for knowing your child. Uh, you know your kid, obviously, but they're little and they're, they still have, they're developing their personalities and they still have whims, a lot of them. So, you know, they're going to do things that are shocking and terrifying. I get to buy toys. Well, here's the fancy car, I'm sure. I had so much fun. <laughs> For his dad. Oh. So Sydney, your mom's gonna have to guess what you bought today. Oh, gosh, I feel bad for my mom because there's like, there's so much stuff. Jar Jar in here? No, your turn, Jar Jar. <laughs> I know, I'm just wondering if you snuck in.